It has now been 10 years. 10 years of lives transformed. 10 years of lives saved from violence. 10 years of poverty turned into stability. 10 years of National Zakat Foundation. In 2013, a group of Muslims in Australia embarked on a mission to ensure that Muslims in need were never left behind. Ours was a community entirely reliant on the government to look after our problems. Outside of social security, Muslims had no systematic way or infrastructure to look after their own. To look after spouses and children abandoned or abused in harmful relationships. To look after refugees or international students unable to receive any financial support in our country. To look after Muslims on the streets because of cyclical poverty or the traumas of life. And to support children with special needs and the desperate families and care that struggle to support them. Our vision at NZF was inspired by this gap and the Islamic obligation for us to look after our own right here in Australia, powered by the blessing of Islam's third pillar. And so was born a community institution that had a crystal clear vision, a confident, self-sufficient Australian Muslim community where no individual in need is ever left abandoned. As we mark our 10 years in operation, we've distributed more than $14 million in Zakar locally to help change some 19,000 families. And in the process, NZF has helped create an incredible infrastructure for the fulfillment of Islam's third pillar right here in Australia. A system that is now a movement, bringing together more and more leaders, organizations, partners, and specialists to help create change where it's most needed in our community. And every year, this movement gets stronger. It is through this movement and its delivery of zakat that NZF is helping alleviate poverty, turning zakat recipients into zakat givers. Whether they are refugees, or victims of abuse, or people left homeless. We're immensely grateful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for his help and to our community for its generous and continuing support. But for us, this is just the start. And as we look forward to the next 10 years, we'll continue to strive every day to build an independent, self-sufficient future for our community. A future in which this great pillar of Islam achieves its objectives and no Muslim is left abandoned. This is our community's future and you are invited.